Yo, 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 what is going on? It's your boy Black Barney bringing another live gameplay commentary here tonight, playing Magic Duels on Xbox One. Uh, we are playing the last game of the season, I think, of uh, King of the Hill. Uh, we're in first place and we're playing uh, Divine Vert, who's the current king. Now, this match is important because. Um, excuse me. Uh, because. I'm a first no matter what, so that's pretty much set. But Divine Vert is tied with Infamous Gemini for third. So if... And Pure Synthesia is in second. Um, so if Divine wins this match, this best of three match I'm about to play, then uh, he makes it to the playoffs of the top three. And if he loses, then Gem would be in... Uh, Infamous Gemini would make top three. So it's very important. So we would, of course, prefer Divine Vert... Uh, getting in because we have a, uh, a better uh, record against him and because uh, we're buds, but um, we want to we wanna make him earn this. So we are playing a deck that we built from Covert Go Blue from his Twitch feed, and it's very much my kind of deck as you're about to see. <laughs> Yeah, it's a mono red deck, which of course I love. I love this stuff. And uh, we like it because it's quick. We'll see how it does. That was a uh, relative. That was actually a really tough choice about what to play between those two. But I figured I might as well start c capping replacement cards immediately on the bull mat, whereas this could save something maybe or push through damage later. Uh, we're not going to be able to get out of grasp range or out of um, languish range, but uh, languish we don't worry about because it should be over by then. But uh, oof, that hurts. Which one's better between these two? I think this one's much better. Four damage with trample? This is not so good, eh? So we sent that land to the bottom, which I think is the right move. We, we'd really like to draw a Madness card now, because we're going to be discarding something next turn for this. So Madness would be nice. Yeah, that works. Man, I wish we could kill our own guy so he doesn't get that three life. That really hurts us. I can't do anything about that, I think. How many cards does this have on it now? Eh? I think we're going to have to crack that. OK, 
Gideon. Like he's at 15 health, man. This sucks. I really think we should crack this. I think we'll do it now. I don't like not having to... Uh, I just want to be really mana efficient here. I think that's the... Oh my god! Ugh! What the fuck do we do now? I guess we shouldn't have discarded that thing, right? What the fuck do we do now? <sighs> really, I, I guess I have to do this, right? Because I gotta get... I can't let him, uh... Do I want to switch this for a token? I don't think so. Ugh. I guess I don't want to switch it for a token. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I guess I should have attacked one more time with, uh... The courier before blowing it up and getting some damage in on uh god look at all this life gain this is a nightmare for us okay we really picked the wrong deck well of course as always if uh, this deck loses this matchup we are gonna toss it oh god those trigger that ally Oh my god, he makes allies. So here we're hitting Gideon for um, three. So we might as well boost him to kill Gideon, right? I don't, I don't think we have a choice. That way we're in better shape. We'll lose a guy, but I mean, we'll have a big guy left. Should I be playing these? I don't think so, eh? No, I don't think so. We'll make him sweat what we're holding. Oh, shoot! I thought that was Senseless Rage. Oh, it's only temporary. Shoot. Oh, my God. This is awful how this deck is... Oh, my God. Look at this. We're playing Mono Red, and we had to play a life gain deck. Couldn't be worse. It's at 22 life, and we're completely out of gas. Oh, my Lord. This could be a bad loss. Hey, why did we kill Gideon? What happened? Does it not give trample? Oh no! Boy, I'm really all over the place, huh? Now he's a 7 7 blocker. Ugh. Oh my goodness. Ah, it's a too little, too late, huh?
Ah, uh, I don't have a choice. Oh yeah, well this fucking game's over. Hey, we're the control player now. I wonder if I'm broadcasting in, in black again. Hey, Jim, it's not going good, buddy. Uh, he's got some kind of life gain thing. It's brutal. Uh, seven, eight, nine. Gotta do this, huh? Oh, that's really not going good. Oh, I shouldn't show him that, eh? Okay, well, that's it. So, that's our first loss with this deck. It's now 2 and 1. Losing to Orzov Ally Life Gain, I guess? Probably just Orzov Allies would do it. Oh my god, I can't believe that Gideon makes allies. Ouch. Okay, well, I mean, we had to mulligan twice there. That hurt, so <clears throat> let's hope it goes better. Uh, Jim, can you see my screen? Is it, am I broadcasting okay? Because last time uh, against you, it was all black. <sighs> so we got to win out. So look, we got to... I mean, he got a pretty good draw there. Let's not... Uh, let's not... Uh, let's not hide that. But, uh... Again, remember, win or lose, we're not too upset. I had to refresh my browser. To make my thing. Oh, maybe that's the trick then. To make me appear. Yeah, I don't know why Twitch does that. So next time it does that, I'll tell the people to refresh their browsers. So, Jim, I'm playing uh, Covert Go Blue's uh, Mono Red uh, deck. Um, the one that's designed for T turn 4 kills uh, that he was playing on his Twitch channel. Um, <clears throat> I think you posted it to No Goblins Allowed, and of course I had to make some tweaks. Um, to make up for the fact that uh, the expansion isn't out yet. But it, it did, I brought it, uh, it was good against the AI, one game's quick, and then I went 2-0 and oh on the ladder, so I was feeling pretty good, but I didn't know I'd run into this, uh, an ally deck, man. I wonder what ally decks are good at besides against this. I wonder what I would have played tonight, otherwise. I guess I shouldn't give up my secrets, but uh, would this? I would have played this. No, I think this would have had trouble too. But this would have been better. There's more removal. Ugh. Okay, well, we'll try to win this out. Ugh. Okay, this is a much better starting hand than we had last game. Last game we had these three things and these two things. We had these five, and then remember this this card was dead. So this is this is I like this much better. We got a, we got he's gonna hate that both games we got this. La last game, Jim, we got this out immediately on him when he was renowned. Like we we're and then he immediately declaration and stoned him, which sucked for us. What's this? A 1-1 one, one, first strike lifelink. Fuck. Okay, so we can either trick him, attack into him, and do this. But I think we're going to do this instead. Because we can blow that thing out of the water after. I think that's the play. I'm tempted to trick him. No, because we got to get this damage through. We need to hit renowned damage so our guy becomes a uh, menace immediately. So th this should do it. So in both games we had turn one, chaser, turn two, call of the full moon, which we're ecstatic about. But he has this very scary thing that can flip on us if ever he gets four life in one turn. And then if he does, we're looking at a four, four life, like this will kill us. And he gets out of our range, except for exquisite. Oh my God, he gets this again. Oh. Jeez. I'm going to have to use this now. 